next one, next step. We're learning how to adapt and building resiliency to the cold weather. The hikes were difficult, but the Marines and sailors to the left and right of you take care of you and you take care of them. Make sure everyone is uh, staying motivated and you'll get through it. The small unit of leadership. Every morning, you know, you get, you get out and uh, you check on your, your Marines, make sure they don't have frostbite on their toes or their fingernails or make sure they're conducting proper hygiene and you make sure they're drinking enough water because a lot of Marines can't tell if they're dehydrating because it's cold out. When you're working at a higher elevation and you're dealing with a lot of snow, it creates a lot of issues as far as uh, not being able to utilize vehicles in the way that we would normally utilize vehicles in the logistics realm. So it forces you to do sleds and snowshoes and skis and hiking is much slower and everything is slower and much more difficult. So it, it forces you to think outside the box as far as how to do resupply, which is a whole new challenge and a lot of fun. I think the biggest challenge that the Marines face uh, being out here is just that it's a unique environment. We've got Marines that uh, this is the first time they've ever seen snow, let alone had to move in it, live in it, and, 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 and try to uh, conduct tactical operations in it. So the, the importance of Marines learning how to uh, construct and, and live in expedient shelters is that they, they may not find themselves always with the ability to uh, live in a tent. Uh, they may be out on patrol and the weather comes in and they've got no other choice but to immediately go to ground to weather out that storm or to weather out some enemy activity and uh, allow them to continue their operations. We're not going on a fast pace, but we'll naturally be faster, okay? I may not go 25 and five, I'm gonna see how everybody's doing, right? But you're also dehydrated and your legs are tired. So I'm not looking to kill anybody because what do we do? We start together. Fish together.